Me first. Oh. Oh, hey guys. Today we're not taking an implant open tray impression. First, uh, this is for number 29. First, we will remove the healing abutment. Like so. Healing abutment removed. And this is an open tray impression coping. Okay, make sure you use the open tray impression coping, not the closed tray. Alright, once you place the open tray impression coping, make sure you move it back and forth. Make sure it's engaged. And then you can use your finger to tighten it. And finally, hand tight the open tray impression coping. Make sure it's nice and engaged and then we like the Invisalign trays um, try it in in patient's mouth look at what the toe should be which is around here so you, I use my high speed with any kind of burr just to make a mark just so that I know this is the hole where the hole comes out and then I just make the hole a little bigger. Like so. And then we try in the tray inside the patient's mouth. So make sure you the open tray impression coping it's poking out out of the tray. Okay? And then we use the GC Assassin Sense Heavy Body Widget. The reason is widget so that it doesn't move. So the impression coping doesn't move in, inside the impression. Go ahead. Also, the system will miss the putty. And then, put the noise right here. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Spray water around, I mean, no, spray air around it. Get the saliva out of the way. And, Put in the heavy body widget impression material, inner proximity and gingivity, um, buckle and lingual, inner proximity and gingivity. Don't use don't use it on all the way across because it's gonna be very hard to remove later on. And that is how you load the tray, how you load the putty, and then we try put it in. Make sure it's poking through. All right after it sets, now you don't have to cover the holes or anything. After it sets, uh, we'll remove it. This will take about three minutes. Now, could you hold it? All right, all right. Um, and let's close it. Then we'll 